Hey everybody, and a welcome to the next map that I'm going to play, which is Nar Shada Docks. This is another map that is part of the Dark Times map pack, and the unique thing with this map is actually that you get a few extra game modes with it, including something called Wave, which is pretty self-explanatory. You need to survive waves of AI that are heading towards you. As you can see, very, very unique, not only look here, but also aesthetically, uh, not aesthetically, map layout wise, we have bridge combat, but bridge combat is so incredibly narrow, yet the AI seems actually to cope with it quite well. We had a few drop over here. Ooh. We've lost the command post. Take it back. Oh, this is cool. Again, aesthetically very pretty, a lot of neon lights. Getting that Corson Blade Runner esque type feeling. Stuff is happening around you. Ooh! Ooh! I saw that. It's a nice little Easter egg there. Look at this. This might actually be my favorite map in the Dark Times map pack. I love urban environments. They're very difficult to pull off, though, in a way where they're aesthetically pleasing. Not necessarily difficult in, like, it takes a lot of time, that's what I mean. Look, a lot of details here. This might actually be something where the Viro Sword unit might actually be quite useful. It's fun too. It's very chaotic in the middle, but because the map is quite big, you can be like, okay, that is too too much chaos for me. I will spawn over here, and then you have a bit more of a relaxed feeling. And that's quite important. Okay, you don't want to make your map just a choke point. And for example, if you don't want to be in the chaos, you can just stand here and like these troopers fire at them from a distance. Very, very cool. Let's actually take a look at what's up here. Hello there, boys. Oh my god. Man, I love this. I have nothing but praise about this. Aesthetically, it fits my profile. Map layout, it's one of the most original things I've ever seen. Like, not only are they, like, small, like, really tiny bridges, there's also... Uh, verticality differences and everything. Ooh, jeez. Let's burn them all. Oh, it's not so low! Oh. Well, then I'm capturing this. The command post is no longer under Empire control. If I had... Well, actually, I don't know. If I had some critique, but they are capturing our points now. It will be, for example, that the Empire has a lot more spawn points in the beginning, including these ones. Like, these ones are super difficult for the Rebels to take them, uh, so how does that work balance-wise? That's what I'm a little worried about. I mean, we have an advantage, but it's not, like, super... Super wide. They're not actually actively losing units, so that might actually be not a problem. I actually haven't noticed that, if that's a thing with the Dark Times map pack. Makes me think about it now. Look how nice and coherent this all is. Again, every building is a little bit different. You have the posters and the billboards. Ah. Oh. You have shish kebab of rebels. What do you want more? Again, you have some fun for the snipers. Huh. 
What a fun map. Burn him! I'm gonna die. Like again, this is I think a great example of creating a super chaotic battle. And also a very concentrated one. It all uh, takes part in a very small area, but not make it a choke point. Ooh. I love this. Yeah, like I said, I'm not kidding. This might be my favorite. Dark Times map. Oh, whoa, that was quick. Like, they have, overall, I think that the quality of the Dark Times map, uh, map pack and the maps itself are very good. But there is sometimes quite a bit of difference. For example, I think the previous one that I did was the Mon Calamari one. Uh, I see a huge difference in quality with that one compared to this. In terms of detail, in terms of, like, map originality. This, to me, is a must-download. It's, of course, also subjective. It's a, it's a taste thing. Again, I, like I said, I love urban environments. I love the, the city environments that people create. Um, oh, that's my own guy. And, for example, there could also be people who prefer forest areas. Or, God help you if you like swamp areas. <laughs> because I can tell you this much. I do not. Again, I, I've said this before. If you make a Dagobah custom map... May the odds forever be in your favor, because they're already one point behind with me. We're losing reinforcements. Come on, Boba. Show what you got. Man, that Han Solo is everywhere. It's like a little cockroach. I think we've also come now to the last of the ground maps of the Dark Times map pack. I know of at least one I haven't done yet. And that's actually one that aesthetically is really not up my alley. However, there are still a lot of space maps. I haven't playtested them yet. I want to see if they're worth making individual videos about. But I also don't know if they're actually used for the campaign. Like, for example, I cannot wait to play this map in the campaign mode. Oh! Okay, now you can actually see that we got a little bit balanced out. We actually did start to lose reinforcements, I saw it started taking. So maybe you can actually set the point to where a certain side starts losing points, and maybe the rebels actually don't do that in this map. Hey, there's the Falcon again. Oh! Because, of course, I like uh, urban environments, I have gotten, of course, also the recommendation to do Soon Ra Desert City. I have reviewed that on the Kanoa channel way back when, and I will do that again here. The only uh, weird thing is on this PC, again, I'm temporarily in Holland. Uh, it's not as powerful as the one I have in back in Japan. For some reason, that map lags when I play it. It's literally the only, the only map that does so. So I'm waiting until I'm back in Japan, and then I will actually make the recording. It's all so coherent, even though they're using way different prop sets. It's incredible. Victory oh. is ours. Yes, indeed. Victory is ours. Oh, jeez. Maybe not.
Oh, there's Han Solo again. Always doing his thing. Oh, come on. Overheated. I like my Han Solo cooked and crispy. Oh, he got a rocket straight to the face. Alright guys, we're about to win this. So again, if you want to check out this map, you can find the link... Oh, I <laughs> pushed him off. You can find the link to this uh, map pack in the description down below. Don't forget to let me know recommendations or requests on certain maps or mods you want to see on the channel. Thanks so much for watching. And I'll see you guys next time.